Hey there, welcome to tonight's live sizing and styling guide. I am super excited to bring you guys a whole lot of new products, um, some new styles, new prints. Uh, so we are going to go ahead and get started. I'm gonna do my little bit of maintenance, so just give me a second. Okay, if you pop on, make sure to say hi. Let me know that you are watching and that you are here. You see, it looks like I might need to adjust my light a bit since I'm in a dark color. And then I'm going to share this to my group. Happy Wednesday. I've been running around like crazy. I know I always say that, but it's like embrace the chaos. That is my life. Like going wild, trying to get all this stuff done in time and get everything prepped and ready for lives and orders shipped and all that jazz. So it has been busy. Um, I actually was just running down here. I'm like, ah, it's 829. So, okay. I am going to share this if I can find it. If you are on, say hi. I see there are a few of you here. Let me know you're watching. Happy Wednesday. How's everybody's day going? It's like the middle of the week, but not really the middle of the week since Monday was a holiday. Okay. I think we are sharing, so that should be good. All right. Well, hello, everybody. Thanks for hopping on. I'm going to give it just a minute, and then we'll get started with these new styles. Um, I can't wait to show you guys this stuff. So, I hope everybody as well had a nice weekend. Oh, I see you guys are saying hello. I was missing all your comments. Hey, everybody. Yeah, I hope everybody had a nice holiday weekend. We sure did, but scramble on Monday when we got home to unpack and do all that laundry and all that fun stuff after a weekend away. So now we're playing catch up. Hey, everybody. All right, well, welcome to tonight's live sizing and styling guide. Um, if you are new here, I am Rachel, and I am going to be going over these new styles for you. Uh, Liberty is not with us today, but hopefully um, she'll be back next time. Let me adjust my light a little. I might have to do this a few times throughout because I'm in a dark color. So if you can't see something, just holler on there and I'll make some adjustments. But um, so tonight we are going to cover a whole lot of new stuff. So we have several new styles, which is exciting. Then we have a couple pieces that have been just a little bit revamped um uh, to make me make them to make them so we love them even more than we already do and then as well we have a couple pieces we love uh in some new prints so hey everybody all right well we will go ahead and get started um and we'll go from there. So I'm going to try to follow comments. We all know how I do with that, where sometimes I do better than others. Uh, so if I miss your comments, I will go back after the live has ended and I will try to answer questions if I haven't already. Hey, Katie. Um, and, and as well, inventory like normal is going to be available for purchase immediately following the live. Um, so I will get that loaded as quickly as possible so that way you guys can shop. Um, ever, if there's something that sells out too quickly you can't get, let me know and I will do my best to try to find it for you. So just give me a holler if um, something isn't available that you would like. And I know I always tell you guys how live, or how shopping goes for me. It's kind of like it does for you. We all know what time that inventory is gonna be available and we all scramble to get as much as we can can or what we're after. So that's always how it goes for me. And I scramble and try to um, get as much in my cart as possible. And then I wait around and try to keep adding stuff. So um, what I get is what I get. But we know that a lot of these things we'll hopefully see again or maybe in some more colors and prints. So um, again, if they sell out, don't be don't be afraid to say something to me because I might actually already have more coming um, are on the way. So, okay, we'll get started. So I am in two brand new pieces today. I'm excited to show you guys these and then I'll take some good pictures of these items after the live so that way you guys can get an up close look at them. Um, but I am in the side seam sash side seam slash or sash top. It's like one of those tongue twisters that you can't say over and over and again. But so this is a new style that we have and you'll see that the, it has these fun ties here. Um, it's more of a fitted tee to begin with. Not super tight, but I'd say it's very comparable to like the um, fit of like our everyday tee. And what's fun about these is these sashes. So you can do something where you tie them here in front and they give you just a fun little detail. Really like a boutique style top. Something 
different. You're not going to find just anywhere. So they are super cute. They're $36. So they're a good price point. And what's nice about these too, is that if you aren't huge about having that right in the front, you can tie these in the back and have that little sash there. So depending on what you're wearing and how you kind of want to feature that little fun detail, um, and of course I didn't mess with it to make sure it looked okay how I had it tied, but you can tie it either direction there. So the back is just going to be the same as the front, if you guys can see, although it does have a seam, if I can find it, that runs across here, um, just to add a little bit more detail to it. But if you tie it in the back, then that gets covered up. Um, but it's really not that noticeable in any of the colors. So this comes now in four colors. I'm going to show them all to you, two of them right now, and then I'll show you the fourth in just a little bit. <clears throat> the one day I didn't bring something to drink down here, now my throat is dry. Okay, so this one that I'm in is called Elderberry. It's a really pretty, um, it's kind of like a maroon plum, if you can see. So it's like a burgundy, but a little bit more purple to it. It's a really, really pretty rich color. Then it also comes in this heathered blue. It's called denim heather. So we know with heathering, it has those few different shades of blues in it, the kind of that speckled print. Really cute, super cute. I love things that have that heather to them. And then it also comes in white. This one I don't have tied, um, but it comes in white, or I think we are calling this ivory. But as a lot of you know, our white is really like an ivory. So that's the other shade that it comes in. And again, these are cool because you can tie them in the front or the back. They're $36 and they are long enough to give you coverage. So you can see that no matter what I'm wearing, I have coverage in the front and the back. I am in my true size medium in this. Um, I did try on a size smaller, but I like the little bit of extra flow that I had in this. Um, you also can adjust it a little bit depending on how tie, tight you tie that sash uh, for how much you want it to kind of hug you. Um, so uh, yeah, I am in this, I am in the medium. Um, the large is just too big as you can kind of see it really is a good fit, like on my shoulders and on my arm here. Um, and this is a new fabric. This is actually, they call it, let's see. Well, it's a cotton spandex. So this is new for us because we don't have a lot that's already in a cotton. Um, we, you know, some of our hoodies are cotton and then our sweaters are cotton, but this is actually a cotton spandex. So it has a really good feel to it. It's a really nice weight um, where it's still lightweight enough for summer, but it has a good weight to it where uh, you can feel that it's a nice shirt that's going to wash and wear really well for you. So this is the new side seam sash top. Um, but these are really fun. So make sure to check these out today. There is another color and I will show you that in just a bit. And you guys, I have a lot to show you today. I have um, a whole lot of outfit changes because I wanted to show you a few things in several sizes. So I am going to try to get these um, or get through these as quick as I can so that way you guys can see everything and we don't take up forever. Um, Janelle, I think you just asked. I'm in a medium, medium in this. Okay, and then I also am in our new moto jeggings. So the moto jeggings, let me see if I can tilt this down a little bit so you can see a little bit more of them. Okay, so the moto jeggings, these are awesome. They are the same fabric as our favorite knit jeggings. So that same feel, the same stretch, they are exactly the same cut. I am in the same size that I wear in the knit jegging. Um, I would not flex sizing at all. The only area that I notice a little bit is here where this, um, where the actual like texture are in the fabrics and I don't know if you guys are familiar with what moto is hopefully you can see this a bit it has these like little different seams here it gives it a real fun kind of punky look um, and they are just fun so it adds a different detail to them super cute this is a new print um, that is again I can't remember names this is just called animal print so if you are looking on the site it's called animal print they're really like a light light tan kind of a dark cream and then they have the two shades um, of tan in them that give you that animal print but aren't these cute so they're super fun I paired them here with the elderberry because I was kind of at a loss for what to pair them with um, because we don't really have a whole lot of items in the tan and brown category uh, the oatmeals really didn't match well with it so I thought adding a little bit of color worked well so that's why I added the elderberry to it because it was kind of that same muted tone I think you could add some fun pops of color to these but I'm always a go-to a black you know black top go-to for me but I really liked it with just this little bit of color and that same kind of muted tone so this is the uh, moto jegging they are let me double check for you but I think that they're the same price um, as our knit jegging oh 
I'm sorry. These are 52. So our knit jeggings are 48. These are 52. And like I said, I'm in my same size as the knit jeggings. So if you're familiar with those, I would stick with your same size in those. The only pair or area again that I don't notice as much stretch would be like in my thigh. So if you feel like you have larger thighs and if you felt like that was an area that the knit jegging was already really tight on you, then I would maybe suggest going up a size if you size down in those originally. Um, then that would be just the area that I would think would be any concern but otherwise they fit the same the other feature on these I almost forgot to tell you is they have back pockets so everybody is like where are we gonna put our phones and that kind of thing well now you have a place these have back pockets so that is just something that I love about these um, they have a faux front pocket but that back pocket is awesome because uh, if you do show your butt a little bit, we like to have something there where it seems doesn't seem so awkward um, with like how the knit jegging was. So I'll give you guys a little close up of these. I'm gonna have to adjust my camera a little bit, I think today just because of what I'm showing you. So please bear with me. Um, so this is the animal print. I'm looking at it up close. It's kind of that, like I said, it's that like darker cream to it. You can see it has that same kind of stripe to it that the knit jegging has, letting you know it's that same kind of fabric. And then a little touch here, they put our little logo on the back pocket. So super, super cute. Yeah, so these um, are really fun. So these are the new Modo knit jegging. Um, they're $52. Like I said, if I'm missing comments, I will come back. Um... Andrea, I would not size down in them if you have thicker thighs like you it, like you did in the knit jegging if you size down in those. So I stayed true to size in the knit jegging. I'm noticing after losing a little bit of weight that I could probably go down a size in them. Um, but this is the same size that I wore in the knit jegging. I wouldn't flex out of these at all because I think that on my thighs that this area I wouldn't want to adjust that at all I wouldn't want it to be any more snug I did put on a size down and they fit me um the only other thing that I noticed as well is they didn't sit as high on me so my they sat lower and so the pockets were then lower you know they sat a little bit lower and for me that was a little bit awkward because I'm used to where my knit jeggings sit um from from before my previous knit jeggings they sit a little bit higher and I found that with these I wanted them to sit in the same place and that was most comfortable for me but they, the smalls, which would be my size down in the knit jegging and in these felt the same. The only area is right here that they felt a little snug, but not even like they were too snug. So if you're on that edge where you're thinking like, hmm, I could have stayed true to size instead of sizing down, stay true to size in these. Don't size down one. So I hope that kind of helps because I know it's one of those hard things where some of us might like the things a little bit tighter or we might be able to deal with, um, you know, having, or if we have smaller thighs and it's not a big deal. So that's where it's, it just becomes a little bit complicated if you are going to want to size down or not in them. Um, I heard some people suggesting to size up, do not size up in them from your true size. If anything, stay true size or size down to your knit jegging size. And I think that you'd be happy with the fit. Okay. Well, I am going to go ahead and get changed real quick. I might just not even wear shoes today because I'm like, I have so many things that I have to like throw on and off. Um, so one second, I'm going to put something else on for you. Okay, so this is a new piece and you'll notice this print is pretty familiar. We're gonna see it in a few things today. Oh, I didn't really wear the best bra for me to be showing some of these pieces, so just bear with me. Um, but I was kind of like in a rush getting changed, and then I was like, oh, I never went and put on my other bra. So this is the Keyhole Tunic. Super cute, super comfy. Um, I am currently sized up one, so I am wearing this as a dress. Well, you'll see it's long enough. It's not quite to my knees, but long enough where I would be comfortable in it. It has that same body as the swing tunic that we love. I'd say it's a very, very similar fit. Um, I would suggest doing the same sizing that you wear in the swing if you would like to wear it tunic style um, or stay true to size or size up one if you would like to wear it as a dress. So I am currently in a large. Now I like the smaller, the medium in the swing tunic. Um, I did have the medium on. It worked just as great. I'm going to show you guys the medium so that way you guys can see it um, on me. But you know me, I'm always like conscious of bearing my legs. And so if I thought as a dress, I'd want to size up one, have that extra room. But you can also see 
feel like, look, if this is a size up, it's not showing too much. It's not way too big. It's just that I'm going to have a little bit more length and a little bit more flow here in the body. So I wouldn't be afraid to size up and still think that you could wear it tunic style and it not be gigantic. So this is called the keyhole tunic. You might wonder why. Um, and again, I'm sorry about the bra I'm wearing because it kind of meets in the middle here. So you're not going to get that full feature back here in the back. It has this little keyhole detail to it. So just that fun little something added where it has that keyhole in the back. Now these are $40, um, so great price point for a cute little summer dress or tunic because you can wear it either way depending on what sizing you do or just what you want to pair with it. These would be really cute with capris or the new crop pixies. So really, really fun new tunic addition to our um, line and it has pockets as always. Our favorite thing about dresses and tunics is pockets. Um, yes, Darlene, this is perfect for shorter girls. I know that some of our stuff is long and you always feel like it's too long and it would maybe look a little bit frumpy. So this is perfect. So this is the keyhole tunic, $40. Now I'm going to put on a medium so that you guys can see. And as you look at how this is a fun like strap. Sorry, again, like I said, I'm wearing not a very good bra for with this. But look at this fun little detail. It has this inch um, that goes around and then comes up here. So just a fun little detail. You're going to see that some of these are going to come contrasting with different colors and then some of them are going to be where they're the same, but just a little fun new piece. So one second, and I'm going to put on a medium so that way you guys can see um, me and my true size. So one second. All right, so this is the medium and a different print or a different a little combination here. Solid navy with that hot pink. This one is super cute. Now this is a medium. As you can see, it's a bit shorter. So I'm at the point where like, I don't want to put pants on. It's still, you know, longer than my finger length. Um, so long enough if you want a little short dress or if you are shorter, that would be perfect. For those of you who don't know, I'm 5'7 um, and I'm about a size 10. So my true size is typically mediums and Agnes and Dora. Um, but I do size up and size down just depending on the look I'm going for. So like I said, we call this a tunic, not a dress, but I was able to size up one to wear a dress style um, and then able to wear my true size here, which for me, I would be more comfortable in as a tunic, not a dress. Um, but I also think in this that I would be fine to go down another size. Um, but if I wanted a little, little less swing in here, but you know me, I do really appreciate um, a lot of the time what the clothing is intended to look like. So to have this looseness and swing in here and not be super tight. So that's why I like uh, my true size in this one. Um, Charlotte, if you didn't catch what I just said, because I know your comments pop up a little bit delayed for me. So I'm 5'7". I'm 5'7", um, and this is short for me as a dress. I don't like to really show off my legs that much. So this is, again, the um, keyhole tunic with that fun little detail in the back. Okay, so I think I didn't bring it out here, but I'm going to grab the other one that came in this color just because I'm not going to have time to put every single new piece on today. So it also came in, it came in these three, um, that fun animal print. It came in this one, which is the navy and the hot pink. And it is called Navy. That's just if you're looking on the site for it, it's under the category Navy. And then it also came in Heather Gray. So Heather Gray um, here where this one doesn't have contrasting, but a super cute, super easy. It'd be, even be fun, you know, as a beach cover up, something to throw on, easy to wear. I just imagine wearing this poolside while my kids are playing and it'd be easy and fun and super, super cute. And again, just 40 bucks. So that is the new keyhole tunic. All right, now I think I'm going to put something else on. I will probably put pants on, so just a second.
All right, I noticed I'm going in a really odd order. Normally I keep things like pretty streamlined back to back to back. Well, now I'm like totally throwing you off. Okay, so I wanted to throw on so you guys could see the Moto Jagging here in the hot pink. I'll give you guys a close up of this one as well. So these are just a super fun pant. And again, you know, I kind of ran into like, what color do I wear with it? And are they too wild to do a print? I think they'd be super cute with a stripe. Um, but I just have it on here with our tiered tunic which I don't know if you guys have seen this before. Uh, we have it in a tank style as well, but I am a huge fan of the tiered tunic. I think that they are super flattering and fun. I am sized down in the tiered tunic in a small, and then these are the hot pink um, moto jegging. So super cute and fun. Um, again, quantities are kind of limited, so make sure to be on the site as soon as the live ends and when I load inventory and try to snatch them up. If I don't have your size, let me know. I'll see if I can track them down. Um, but they are just super cute and fun. A little bit wild, but if you pair them with something just solid like this, you can kind of tame them down a little bit and um, still have a really cute outfit with some fun pops of color. Same thing that I did with um, those purple or the Byzantine pixie pants you know those are kind of bright and so I always run into like how bright is too bright and so I always paired black with those um but I just love the hot pink so these are really really fun super cute um addition to our line and then this is like I said it's the tear tunic um that I have on with it just for something solid and simple um Darlene, well, I kind of talked about the moto jeggings a little bit before. Now, I think they run pretty similar to the knit jegging. The only area that I notice much difference uh, where they might be a little bit tight is right here where that, like, that actual, um, you know, texture is added in or where those little seams are all placed. Sorry, I'm not really great with the technical words. But that could be a little bit snug. So if you feel like you have a bigger thigh and you're concerned or if you felt like the knit jegging was already tight in that area, I would maybe not size down in them like you did in the knit jegging and stick to your true size. But I would not size up in them. So hopefully that would help you. But I'd say they're really, really, really similar um, to the same fit as the knit jegging. Just that's the only area that I noticed anything where it could possibly be bothersome to some. Um, okay, well, let me change real quick and I'm going to show you guys something else new. Okay. Thank you guys for being patient while I change. I always try to be quick, but I'm always worried I'm going to come up here with my skirt, like, tucked in my underpants and my bra or something. So, okay, well, this we know and we've seen and everybody loves. It's the mesh dress. Um, and this one is actually in navy. So this is that dot mesh dress that we absolutely adored. It came in cream and it's come in black. And now it came out in a navy version. So they are super cute. Now, last time we had talked about some things that we could wear them over. Um, the big one being the callow dress. They are really cute with the callow dress. I actually had one here so you guys could see them together. This is the navy over over that yellow sunflower callow dress really cute I don't have a lot of the yellow or the sunflower in stock right now but I am getting these um, I think by Monday I looked at my tracking I'm getting a whole size run of the yellow callows so if you want one of those let me know and I can hold it for you and let you know when they arrive um, but super cute with the callow and then I have it here because we had talked about what would it look like over a Fisher dress and I had sold all of my size and wasn't able to pair them um, before we thought of this. So this is the with a Fisher dress. Now I have this on over the coral, which I am just a total navy and coral um, lover. So I like this combination a lot. It's a good length together. Now I am in a small in both of these. Um, the Fisher dress for me feels a little bit snug because I typically am a medium, but I really wanted to show it with this coral. So I thought I'd like squeeze into it, but you can see it's a little bit tight for me, like in the arm area. So I would say, you know, Fisher dresses always pretty much stick true to size. And then uh, I like to Size down one in the mesh uh, dot dress because they are they can be a little bit roomy in the sleeve they're definitely plenty of room here in the body so I like to size down one in those um, but typically the Fisher dress true to size uh, yeah so this is cute because it's fun that it's separate so you can layer this over different dresses I did have it in my don't know but over this red slip dress I had put that together that was really cute now the slip dress is just a tad bit longer than um the mesh dress but it still looked really cute together <coughs> excuse me <coughs> sorry 
sorry, trying to see if I have a drink around here. <coughs> and I don't think I do. But yeah, so a super cute combo super way cute way that you can um change up your outfit just a little bit or a dress that you already have and know and love so this is the navy mesh dot slip dress and i'm gonna get changed one second <coughs> Sorry, I also had to run and get something to drink. And the only thing, or the first thing I grabbed was orange juice, which is odd for me. But I don't want to hack my way through the rest of this. Okay, so here is that other color in the uh, side seam sash top that I had showed you guys a little bit ago. Um, so this is, again, I'm in my true size in a medium in this. That's super cute. I just love these. And then now I have on a new pair of knit jeggings. These, so these are knit jeggings in a lighter shade. Um, these are called the light denim. Super cute. Uh, that light denim we were talking about is really, really kind of come making a comeback. Really fun. And you know what else is new on these? Pockets. These now have back pockets. So if you know and love our knit jeggings, you are going to love these. They um, are the same fit. I would suggest doing the same size. Again, I'm in a medium in these. They feel snug, but I, I think more just because they're new and I'm used to wearing my other ones that I have worn and worn and worn and worn and worn. And then I'll wear several days in a row and they get a little bit stretched out and they're, um, you know, just super comfy and they're much softer, you know, after you wash and you wear them, oh, 20 or 30 times because they're your favorite pants. So these, I think they fit exactly the same Again, I did put on a small in these just to see. And for me, you know, I like where these sit on me. You know, they sit above my belly button. So they're a nice high fit, but I feel like they help hold my mom belly in a little bit. Now, when I put on the small, they sat a little bit lower. And then I noticed that my pocket sat a little bit lower. And so I could wear a small, but the medium really in these was the best fit for me. It's my true size, but I would suggest staying with your size that you like in the knit jegging in this pair as well. So I'm going to show you guys, these came in three colors. Um, I am, like I said, I am in the light denim. So that is this one. This is the same color. If you got or saw the light, uh, the pixie crops in the light blue, it's the exact same shade as that. And again, these now have the back pocket. So they have that fun pocket and that little Agnes and Dory detail on them. Just super cute and fun. Um, they also come in... Uh, this one, which is called the light blue, and again, back pockets on those, and then they come in a gray. So if you're wondering the difference between the gray and the charcoal that was previously out, let me show you that. So this is the new gray. This is the charcoal. So it's quite a bit lighter. Okay. So if you're wondering or thinking like I already have the charcoal, I don't need the gray. They are different shades. And then of course the gray now comes with that back pocket um, feature. But again, they're the same with the length and the adjustable cuff and that detail. Now I'm going to show you guys the comparison of the lighter blues because you might be wondering or when you look at the stock photos it's kind of hard to tell the difference so one is called light blue and one is called light denim okay so there is a bit there is I think quite a bit of difference when you have them together now if you have them separate and you're wearing them separately you might think like oh they're pretty similar but when you actually have them together they're quite a bit different so this is the light denim I'm sorry the light denim light denim same as the pixie crop light blue Okay, and then this is our original denim. So you guys can see all those different shades. So they clearly are three different shades of blues, very much different, um, but that light blue is going to be your middle shade and the light denim is the lightest. Um, Vanessa, they do not come in the darker denim yet. 
So hopefully, I'm sure we will see them. We do know that these the new style is coming in that early fall pre-order in July too in some other colors and prints. So that's exciting. Those are going to be coming with the back pockets. Um, but right now, they don't come in the darker denim. So right now, they come in the two shades of denim. And then they come in the gray. Okay. So hopefully, that makes sense. Um, and I'm doing really bad at following comments. So sorry, guys. Okay. Um, I'm going to go back through comments because I'm doing a really poor job of reading comments and, and that kind of thing as we go, which we all know I always kind of struggle with. So hopefully that helps you guys. So these are the new knit jeggings with a pocket. Now I do not know because I have not looked since they aren't on my site yet, if they are going to load or be worded any differently to identify to you that they have a back pocket. I would make sure to look at that stock photo. A lot of the time they're showing like a picture with a hand in a pocket or something so that you can see that there. But again, just so you guys know the lighter blue. So the light denim, the light blue, and then the gray are the new ones. And those are the same price, the 48. So lots of new pants today between the um, new jeggings and the motos. So those are fun. I have one more top that I'm, or two more tops. I have a lot of things still hanging in there that I haven't put on yet. But I want to show you guys another new style. So I'm going to put that on real quick for you. I'm moving slow today moving slow today all right well this one is super fun this is the tie sleeve top um, these are really cute just for something fun easy a little bit different um, I am in the red so this is the um, ivory and wine it says Sorry, ivory and wine stripe, super cute top. Now these are $36, so a good price point for a fun little top. They all have this great detail where you'll see that the stripes um, go a different direction on the neck, which is cute. Then they have this little hole here in your sleeve where then it ties just a fun, fun, fun little detail. Um, they are super cute. They are a nice length, so they're not gonna be super long like some of our other tunics or even as long as some of our other tees, but they are just a really fun, new top. Now right now they come in, I think I just have three stripes. I have a black stripe, navy. Here, I'll show you the stripe. So they come in this and you'll see it's a French terry fabric. So it's a lighter weight French terry, quite lightweight. So still perfectly fine for summer, but again, has that nice body and nice feel to it. Uh, it comes in black and then it also comes in a navy and ivory stripe that I have in stock but super cute. Now sizing on these, I am in a small here. I put on a large, I put on a medium and I put on a small. Um, I would say that the bodies of these fit just like your everyday tee. So I would do the same size in this as you do in the everyday tee. If you already have those, um, typically people size down one. If you don't have an everyday tee and you aren't familiar, I would suggest sizing down one. Cause as you can see, this is still quite flowy in my body. I've got plenty of room here. Um, but the only area that would be concerned that people ask about is this the tie here and mine at first when I put this small on it was a little bit snug but you can easily adjust these the ties are working so you can make those bigger if you want and I mean you can't tell that I loosen this up it doesn't look like funny or odd or anything like that um, but I liked the small better for the fit in the body and it still fits nice on the neck and all of that so this is size down one super cute new style um, it's that lightweight French terry, Mindy, if I didn't catch you or answer that answer that before you asked your question. So it's a really, really, really lightweight French terry. So it has that French terry feel on the inside of it, but it's really lightweight. So it's perfect for summer. Um, yeah, Diane, you would want to do a medium in this. You would definitely want to do a medium in this. Okay. So this one is cute. So I hope you guys love this new style. Just something fun and different. I like that it's a little bit of a shorter top to wear with some of these new pants that we have. And so really cute. And these are $36. $36 for this new top. This is the... 
Let me double check so I give you the guys the correct wording. And you know, it's always good to take notes during the live so that way you know what you're looking up and what you're after when you're on the site. Um, this is the Thai, oops. Okay, this one is called the tie sleeve top. Very easy, <laughs> the tie sleeve top. And, the, and I said $36, I'm sorry, these are $32, even better. These are only 32. So really good price point for a super cute fun top. So tie sleeve top. All these are like tongue twisters today. But yeah, super cute, super fun, new style. And I have that still on with those same knit jeggings. Um, Okay, one more thing I think that I want to put on just you, so you guys can see, and then I think we will wrap this up. We're running a few minutes later than I usually like to do. So just one second. things out that I've decided I just don't have time to try on. All right, so again, this print, this new print that we like, or that is new to us today, this animal print, how cute, is now in the Limitless Button Tunic. So for those of you who have gotten these, I know a lot of you have already gotten them since our last live, um, these are so cute and so easy to wear. Um, Mom, how much is the grass wreath? You guys are funny. I'm not selling decor right now, only clothing. Um, so these are just super easy, easy to wear. I am size down one here in a small, and it is just super comfy and cute. I just have it paired with a black um, everyday tee, which this is one that we talked about size down in. I'm in a small here, so size down one in the everyday tee. And I just love these. So now there's this limitless button tunic in this print and then the limitless tunic also came in this deep gold so if you like the color of that hair dress or some of the other um, new gold pieces that we have the limitless tunic is now available in that same deep cold gold so today I will be posting both of these on the site limitless tunics are $40 these are the same price as the ones that came out just last week or the week before whenever those came out I thought that this gold one would be really super cute because I just love these two together um, I just love the slip dress with the limitless tunic but I thought that it would be really cute with the navy so that's your gold and your navy really summery fun color combo but kind of your classics paired there together and that gold is fun because it's not super duper mustard it actually has like some goldishness to it goldishness I don't think that's a word but we're gonna do it today um but it just has a little bit of like a gold hint to it so it's not like super mustard but it's a little bit more rich than that um, and then this print again, we're just seeing it in everything, uh, came in our fitted tank. So finally some fitted tanks and prints, which is fun. And this print that everybody is crazy about in all kinds of items, um, it came in the fitted tank. So if you're looking for this swing tank that this came in, sadly, I didn't get any. I don't want to make anybody like cry over that because I know it's sad, but, um, I didn't get any of the, the swing tanks, but I did get the fitted tanks in that print and um, it's really pretty. So hopefully swing tanks will be able to get some more of those and more prints and colors will come in those. Um, Sarah, sizing, sizing for the limitless tunic, I like to do my normal swing size um, or a size down one. So I like a medium in the swing or a small in a swing and I am size down one here to a small. So I would suggest going down one size from your, your normal. Um, the fitted tanks, now the fitted tanks let me see if I have my size out here. Here, I'll put one on so you guys can see. I said I wasn't going to do it anymore, and now I am, but it's just easier for you to see. Um, the fitted tanks, I feel, run snug, so I like to size up one in them, and I find that that's the best fit for me. So this is a large. Now I am 5'7", about a size 10, and I normally am a medium, but this is a fitted tank in the large. So this is me up one size. 
as you can see it still is nice and long has nice coverage um you know it's a little bit roomy in here so it's not super duper snug but i am always conscious of my belly so i don't like to um have stuff super tight so i do like to size up one when um you know when things are more fitted so i've worn a medium if i'm tucking it in because then you don't see my belly um and i've worn a medium if i'm gonna layer it underneath something you know like a hoodie or underneath a cardigan that's gonna be bought under like the limitless tunic then i'm okay in a medium but if i'm just gonna wear this by itself size up one it would be my suggestion um Yes, I will show you the flower print tank. Isn't that pretty? So this was what um, one of those wrap maxi skirts came in. Was this pretty? And then it came in a swing tank too, which sadly I wasn't able to get any of. My fingers were not fast enough that day. Yeah, so these new animal prints are fun. I know we have a lot of animal print lovers, and a lot of the time we see animal prints in, like, the blacks and grays and that kind of thing. So fun to see it in this, like, the tans. Great for summer. And then this is a true cream background. I don't know if we really talked about what the color background is. So it's really quite cream, um, is which so it's nice. It's not real white, but that cream, and then with the fun detail to it. So those are cute. I think that is everything then. So... What we have new today, fitted tanks are $22 too. I don't think I said that. So there are the two new fitted tanks. Um, there is the mesh dress and just the color navy, which is new today. Um, there are the side seam sash tops. Side seam sash tops in those four new colors. They're all fantastic colors. Great for summer. There was the blue, the ivory. Um, then there was like the mauve that I it was mauve or I don't think it's out here um so there were these two that mauve pretty color and that dark elderberry so those four colors great colors uh there is the tie sleeve top um the keyhole tunic so that one is coming in three the heather gray and that keyhole just because so you guys can see it up close that's the back side of that with that keyhole detail um, so those are cute. So it comes in the heather gray and then it comes in the navy with the hot pink and it comes in the same fun animal print. So, oh, moto jeggings, new knit jeggings with the back pockets, all kinds of great new stuff, you guys. So I think that covers it. Are there any last minute questions before I sign off and get inventory loaded? If you are new, I do these um, live sizing and styling guides every time that we get new inventory in. So make sure to join my group uh, if you want to make sure to follow along with these so that way you guys can see suggested sizing and fits and up close prints and colors and that kind of thing. Um, make sure to follow my group so that way you guys can see all of these every time new inventory hits us and and then as soon as these are finished I load my inventory and you all can shop so let me know again if something sells out if I can't find if I don't have it I'm happy to try to find it for you or I'll let you know if I already have some coming and I think that's all oh colors for the stripe top they came in the a navy navy and ivory stripe the wine and ivory stripe and black and ivory stripe those are the three colors that I have Okay, so I am going to sign off of here, shoprachelclark.com. If you would like to shop the inventory as soon as this is over, you may press refresh as many times as you want until the inventory pops up for you, what you're looking for, um, or I will post in my group when I get inventory loaded. It should just take me a few minutes today. I'll get that loaded for you guys to shop, and then um, if you have questions, feel free to send me a PM. If you have comment questions here that I haven't answered or that they haven't been answered by somebody else who's following along, I will try to address those as well. So thank Thank you guys for watching it's always fun to do these um thank you guys for being in my group i don't i don't feel like i tell you enough how grateful i am um for your support and making this such a fun adventure for me so thank you thank you for um being here with me so everybody have a great night happy shopping and i will chat with you all soon see ya